And Mr. Illich not only loved his Tigers and Red Wings, but he also cared greatly for his Little Caesars family. And tonight, our Coco McAvoy talks with one Metro Detroiter who shared with her a letter Mr. Illich wrote to him 26 years ago. When you think about Mike Illich, you might think about his sports, entertainment, or food empires. But something else about him is that he was an incredibly loving and caring person who helped a lot of people. People like Rich Gibson, who has a remarkable story. And we met up with him today at Joseph's Coney Island in Northville. Everything that I have memory of with Mike Illich is good. Rich Gibson getting emotional because those memories make Gibson think of his own father who died when he was just seven years old and how the two of them would see Illich promoting Little Caesar's Pizza Treat throughout his neighborhood in Garden City. He was rubber banding uh, flyers to people with door handles and that wasn't real common back then. By the age of 26, Gibson had a serious drinking problem, but his sobriety started when he took the job as a store manager at Little Caesars. It occupied my time early in my recovery. I had no time to think about drinking. So he decided to write a letter to Illich, thanking him for being a part of his recovery. My area supervisor gave it to him, and he told me at the time, don't be surprised if he doesn't contact you in some way. But Illich did write him back, congratulating him and saying, quote, overcoming adversity builds character, and I commend you on your success in your recovery. Gibson has now been sober for 29 years, and though Illich has passed on, Gibson says his legacy and kindness will never be forgotten. When I was drinking, I was not a good person. Now I feel like I'm a I'm a pretty good person, so that structure helped me. I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4.